do kind of think we found the amulet, but at the same time, I think we did not. Yeah, we found it. Okay. Boop. Missing that one. How many of you have actually played the Castlevania? Since for me it's the first time playing it. I haven't sadly even played the other ones on the Syria. Just somehow completely missed everything. Is it here? Oh, there is nothing else. Good morning, the Bat Cave. How are you today? Played Symphony of the Night and some of the older ones. Okay, where did the uh, 2D ones? Played on PS1. Okay. They are. Okay. So, something that I kind of would like to play as well one day. Can't take fire. You have played most of them. There is a few you haven't played, namely the handheld Marines and Lords of Shadows too. Okay. Wait. Is this the place where we were? Yeah, this is the place where we were. Where was the another one? Oh, here was something. That looks like there is something behind it. And it looks mini boss fight, maybe. You can break door on your own. And it's less border. Damn. Oh fucking hell, wrong button! No, don't murder me, pretty please. Thank you. If you're not fan of a 2D platforming, wouldn't recommend Castlevania. However, Bloodstained is well worth worth picking for. Ah, uh, well, it depends on the game. Like I do keep saying that I hate puzzles and platformers and such, and still like I freaking love Hollow Knight. So I guess it depends a lot on the game. I don't think the spider is gonna fit through. Whoop. You have found one of the princess star roads. Bleep bleep. Okay, I was 100% sure that it would spawn more spiders. Right, well, this is gonna be Kyoti's for me. Whoop! Whoop! I do know I could just run away from them, but I do find this quite a funny. Because they are not even hard to kill, to be fair. You just need to press two buttons. 
and they won't be able to, as far as I know, attack you during you are kind of glory killing its other of them. Yeah. No, I'm not sure. Like, does it work with uh, higher difficulties as well? Probably, maybe. Whoop! Can I jump here? Symphony of the Night is a good one to start with. If you want to venture further back, you'd also recommend Super Castlevania 4. Are they something that I can still nowadays get for the PC? Possible? Or do I need uh, another platform? You don't think so, sadly. DM. Of course. Boop. You sure the collection is on Steam? You haven't checked as it's easily emulated. Yeah, the issue with the emulating is that, you know, I can't do it. Uh, so it's it is illegal to emulate something you don't own the original game for. So I completely avoid doing that. Boop. Okay, that did not go well. You have Castlevania Advanced Collection on Steam, but it doesn't include Symphony of the Night. Okay. Clip. Nope. Nope. I'm questioning, do I get help from that? Okay, so I don't get help from that. Is a fancy armor you have. Stop. Ah, damn it! There's also Castlevania anniversary collection that includes some of the earlier entries in the series. Once again, not all of them are included. Did you see the power that resides within those crystals? The crystals Hi, Finn, how are you today? Useful in combat. You can find crystal shards scattered what? all over the place. I often go in search of them. How can I hear your voice? I'm not moving my lips. I have the gift. I can also read minds. But that's kind of a perfect way of preserving the legacy of their franchises. Work perfectly for Silent Hill and MTS as well. In return, I catch evil souls so that he can absorb their energy. Without it, he will stop working. But there's something different about you. Cooking. Ooh, what are you making this time? So we won't kill you. I'm relieved to hear it. Nah, as if they could. Don't that's okay, my face. Okay. Let me read your thoughts. Don't fucking that's my face. So you won't no. get threatened with butter cable walking. What's wrong? Mm -hmm. So it's one of those Why days, I guess. Kill the Lords of Shadow and take their power. You mean to save us all? The one you know. No, I'm meant to be the Lord of the Shadows. Lord Stain, Ritual of the Night, what be your substitute for a Symphony of the Night? I okay. Am not Hi, Kirfan, how are you today? We are coming with you. You won't make it on your own. No, Claudia. I must do this alone. I know the way. You don't. You need me. You need him. Very well. Still feel a horror roll. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Hopefully it gets better. And I sent you something fun. Oh no. Look at the happy skeletons. Thank you for the subscription. I appreciate it. Also, hi Ray's. How are you today? But you have been here since the beginning of the stream, you promise. 
I know, I know. I saw your name on the list. Unsocialized pack pigs. Mm -hmm. Hope I get going, Queen. Have a great day. Okay, have an amazing rest of your day, Track Duck, and thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. Hopefully, we'll see you another time again. Fate has played its hand, and now the die is set. Still not very well, I'm actually. Child mm. will play her Understandable. Part somehow, Doing pretty well, just pay to rent, bought some groceries, and put some gas in your car. For our quest. Nice! The golem that protects Happy the girl has something that could prove very what useful. What groceries you bought? Something good unforeseen. Food. Something delicious by any chance. See your destiny before By the way, Allegedly, you should indeed. be receiving the book today. <gasps> okay, I do need to go check the PO box then. For thousands of years, this city overflowed with life. It was a sanctuary of magic, wisdom, and harmony. These people were the ones that created the crystals which you've already seen. They didn't need armies for protection. Their powers were enough to thwart any threat. That is, until the Lycans came. Queen, you just remember to do a slur stream of your PS4. Uh, I don't currently have a PS4, but I can borrow PS4, so yeah. I do still have the capture card, so it is something that can be made. White rice, flatbread, and Mike's heart lemonade. Sounds good. Sounds good. My father was one of the last. He hid me. He created the Black Knight to be my protector. We have been running ever since. Um, the um, um, Hi, Abuski. How are you today? Behind those doors awaits the last of those titans. The only way Hi Tarna, how are you today? Doing okay, just got home from work. Yes, I hope your birthday wasn't too annoying. Oh yeah, you also bought bed breakfast. Besides, let's hope it works and you get rid of them. We don't have time to lose, Gabriel. Main character empty, alright. Claudia is a mute orphan girl who lives in the ruins of Akarta, the destroyed capital at, of a once great civilization. The race that created the city lived very long lives, often over many centuries. And Claudia shares this trait, having endured innumerable years in the dust and decay. She has developed telepathic powers by communicating with her loyal guardian, the Black Knight. This is an ancient form of communication favored by her ancestors. The strong bond that she has developed with her armored protector has saved them both on many occasions. Claudia is brave and carefree, unafraid to confront danger. Yet deep within is a sadness that will never leave her, close of her beloved father. Cool outfit, thank you. Oh, okay, just remember there is a Castlevania bundle on PSN now. Castlevania Requirement, it has two games worth getting Symphony and Rune of Blood. Oh, okay, okay, that's good to know. Could read this as well. Swamp Trolls are a rare subspecies of the larger Gale Troll. Although similar in appearance to their dry land cousins, the thick fur has been replaced with a slimy coating, similar to wet mold with spider, so it's a damper weather of their habitat. Swamp trolls are ferocious in the battle and display a cunning that believes their outward appearance. Because I really want to, you know. Oh no, there is a lot of stuff. Kremlins. Oh no. More talk. Rocks are principal strength of large Lunganthrope raiding parties. Some of them are blessed by the Dark Lord himself, which gives them new powers such as improved strength and wound regeneration. Due to the nature of this blessing, these powers are heightened by a full moon. 
Little is known about this fierce wolf-like beast, except that they appeared soon after the coming of the Lunganthrop Dark Lord. Despite their wild looks, works are fairly intelligent creatures capable of being tamed by lesser Lunganthropes. Or ride them in battle. Works are ferocious creatures that attack opponents with razor-sharp claws and sharp deadly teeth. The <laughs> Dark Lord, yes. Goblin, this diminutive, mischievous and crappy creatures usually avoid contact with humans. Goblins make their homes around the roots and mossy damp areas and like to hunt in packs, although they can be aggressive when threatened. Goblins usually prefer to keep far from men and their dwellings. Goblins are a species on the verge of extinction and before too long will pass into history and then myth. Ooh. Wait, not yet. A large part of the danger in the swamps lies in the hands of creatures known as naiads. These living things are usually passive, lying unconsciously on the riverbeds and in muddy damp places, mating until someone stumbles between rains. When they attack, their unfortunate victims usually mistake their limbs for princes and are soon drowned and eaten. In days gone by, these once beautiful creatures were worshipped and sacrificed as were made to them. But they are now forgotten by humans and have become evil predators, plaguing both wandering man and beast alike. Hmm. And the rest of them we can read later on. But yeah, these are quite interesting and I do like how they have made the freaking inventory. Well, not inventory, the stories, the stuff that you can read, the music is fucking good. So, so far the only thing that I don't like is the fucking make the bark run because I press the buttons it says and I still can't make it happen. Alright. You need a complete dark crystal to activate this statue. Alright. Alright. So today I need to after stream, remember to check the PO box. Boop. Freaking love this ability. Boop. Uh, also, Reis, what was the day when you wanted me to read it? Because I remember it was during this month now. But I don't remember the specific day. At the moment, at least. Oh, fucking hell. Oop. December 13, your birthday. Okay. Thirteen. Need to remember that. All right, we found something. Ooh. You found a crystal shard. We need three more now. Three more. Freaking four shards. Ooh. So, for a moment, on the 13th of December, I haven't even checked what day it is. Let me actually see what big day is it gonna be. De -de -de. If I can use my calendar. Mm. 13. It's Monday. Okay, yeah. Welcome in raiders, welcome everyone, and thank you for the raid, I proceed it. Hi Trust, how are you today? Could I get a shout out for Trust? Thank you for the follow, I proceed it. How was your stream? I was lurking way earlier. Yeah, how was it? And still thank you for the raid. Welcome everyone, welcome in. How are you all today? 
And yes, as I was supposed to say, um, so 13th of December, you'll get a small part of Queen of Reed's stories in this stream. We'll see how it goes, though. It was fun. A lot playing around with builds in Outriders. Oh, thank you for the follow. I proceed. Has it Outriders changed uh, after it has been now out for a while? I think it has been out for a while. I remember watching it back in the time when it was just about to be released. Remember, Thank you for the lurk. I proceed it. We'll leave you a lurk as you head to bed. Have an amazing stream. Okay. Sleep well, sweet dreams, and thanks for stopping by. I proceed it. And still thank you for the raid. A raid. The lurk as well. Can't even think anymore. Great. Yeah, Tatus put out a small content update, but much needed, with DLC coming next year. Oh, okay. There. Did they have at some point some sort of uh, server issues? Because I remember there was someone who talked about it. But, to be fair, my knowledge with that game is zero. It's all about me watching it. Somebody else play and thinking about maybe one day, maybe. Alright. Now where in the fucking earth I was supposed to go? Here? No. You will see there is something else there. Can jump there. Oh, there. Whoop. Freaking love the daggers in this game. They make things so freaking easy at times. Maybe a little bit too easy, but at the same time, it's like nice if you're struggling, you could just freaking throw a dagger to everything and not struggle anymore. Alright. What? Hmm. Remember, we still need two more crystal shards. Uh, fuck. Where did I almost fall? Wait. Back at the beginning of the map. Damn it. So how in the hell I get there? Oh. Complaining works. Every damn time. Oh no. What? Thank you for the follow. I proceeded. Camera angles are fucking me over once again. It's fine. Yeah, I, I have a feeling that I will die a horrible death by three big Lincolns, but it's gonna be fine, right? Just don't get hit! Easy!
Oh, fucking hell. have fucked up I have would have been able to mount that one which would have made things so freaking much easier no okay just let go Whoop. well not mount but kill anyway fucking hell you've won all right ticket but none open damn also hi Tui how are you today Oh fucking hell my We still need two more crystal shards. Oh fucking hell. Oh fuck. Ah, uh, stop, 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 stop. Now would be a great time to actually be able to see my heart rate. Fried chicken is delicious. Oh fucking dick. Since I do feel the heart rate is coming out of my freaking throat. <gasps> kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it! How did you come to this game? Somebody recommended it or you wanted to play it for years? Uh, I got it gifted from my friend and he said something like I hope you play it one time so I put it on the poll and let you guys to choose what would we be playing next and well it won't won vote so yeah here they are zero freaking regrets about it so far, I have really liked it. We still need two more crystal shards. I'm just hungry. Oh, well, I do hope that you get some food soon. Um. Okay. That is a fucking impatient character. I still need the crystal shards. Yeah, I do hurt you a few times already. Whoop! You have pudding. Well, that is something. Whoop. Okay. Did we got something new? No. Alright. Just one more. There it is. can break this obsidian. Ah. Alright. Like the setting of the Castlevania, that barbar fools of places and castles. With the dark crystal selected press and hold the button to destroy it for less vision content inside. Alright. Great. Now come back here. Do not waste the crystal or you'll have to find another one. Yep, wrong button. Oh fucking hell. Whoop! Whoop! But yeah, I do like it how it looks like as well. Definitely my type of a game. Bonk!
Oh, and it can't get up there. Okay. You found a scroll. The people of Agartha used the shadow of gemstones to power many different devices. This knowledge is still survive, su still survives in the giant stone doors that block the path to the chamber of the titans, which can only be opened with the energy of a complete dark crystal. However, I cannot find the correct way to do such a thing. Fucking no, I don't want to unlock the solution. The fabled city of Akarda, an amazing sight and one which I never thought I would see. It is very dangerous here. The city is teeming with lichen and werewolves. So I have taken to searching for the crystal nodes as, once you collect four of them, you can create a dark crystal capable of unleashing a demon from the shadow plane. This is extremely useful for annihilating many enemies at once. Queen is literally breaking the game. It's level geometry. <laughs> I have heard the legends of necromantic wars and the advanced civilization of the Akhartians. It is said one of their titans of war lies near these paths parts. I hope the god of the Dark Lord never finds and uses one of these behemoths, as they are easily capable of destroying entire cities. I will search the city for clues to its final resting place and hopefully find a way to destroy this abomination. Did it, did it, did it, did it, did it. 